Hello people from the Ravenfield community. Today I will show you how to make a Ravenfield map with Unity. So it's pretty easy. First of all you click if you have installed Unity. You click on new. Then this will load here. And I will make a island stones map. You can do whatever you want. So, and I will create a project. So, the project open, and the first thing you will have is a light that you can see here. There we go. You need this, don't delete it. And the camera for a cameo preview. You can also click on game. You can see the camera. And what we are gonna do, we're gonna make a terrain. Like you see on the most pictures of I wouldn't place. And first of all, you click on main camera. Also click here. And delete. Because you don't need it at the moment. I will move the light a little bit from my view. Then you make a left right click. Right click. For opening this menu, go to 3D object and go to the terrain. Well, the most people who saw the video of Ivan Place who showing you this, and now you got a big, big field. You can move with the with these with the red. You can move it to the X X. You can move with the. Well, uh, so I need to move here. You can also just move the this box. You can move the blue one, and you can move the green one. What we're gonna do? We're gonna make the map. So first of all click on inspector and you got a lot of stuff here for the most people they don't know what they do now so you, uh, first of all you, uh, I will check the terrain weight and we'll make it 500 so you don't need to do this and then you have this drawing thing with the paint so I you can choose your brush and now I'll make now you can make some mountains I will speed up this section So now we got a beautiful mountain way, however you want to call it. I will use this here to make a little bit more detail on it. You don't need to do that. If you want, you can do this, but I'm not going to do that. With the open sea, you can make how fast it should build. And with the brush size, is how big you want to brush with the paint stuff. So, and see, it's for the first time a little bit more easier. You know, so that this is easy for you. And don't forget to uh, make a thumbs up if it helped you. So, now we get this beautiful map. It looks beautiful, and I think I'm gonna make this for the new map. And. As I say, we make an island stones map. So, you go to this paint texture and you go to edit textures. And add. So, first of all, if you don't get, you only got the default. 
you can go to materials asset store and you search grass I normally use uh, painted grass hand paint this is what I use then you click on import package and it will download for the most people it says yeah you need to uh, log in yourself so you need to log in and stuff with like this so then if you, if you load here then you have the uh, import unit package you click on import now you will see on the assets here that there will be a folder called a hand painted grass texture hand painted grass texture so you can open it and you don't need to so then you click on the map you can click everywhere and then edit textures add texture select and paint it I will select uh, 3D 2D you don't need to you can also known and add and well it looks beautiful beautiful but there is something missing like the base base for the raven team or for the eagle team and at one point it looks not bad press <laughs> looks pretty good so um then if you want you can also go to models and install some we do this too I used for my maps uh, models not from me but like stones burn but I'm not gonna install it yet I will install a stone stone texture material these assets called assets cause just make the game looks a little bit more interesting and in the future update of from steel raven his, he said that um, he's not going to be able to get his props now it will load. so we search stone and i don't know if we find one but we will find one too so you hear stone wall stone just everything yeah this is what i forgot i want to search what is search it's a uh, pretty big so well i'm gonna cut this so um the texture pack has been loaded and there's a uh, pretty much so I will import this, this doesn't take as long as it would do, and hold on, hold on, so everything loaded perfectly, and yes, the texture is not in, so we click again on the map, click on paint texture and the paint icon you click on add texture and put in another stone uh, texture sorry and then you're gonna choose it and you can draw with the paint tool sort of stones and it looks more detailed so 
I'm gonna do this in a few seconds. Pressurize is a little bit too big. Yeah, it should be more like looking like snow. So you see it's pretty easy to make, it looks very cool with the shader, see it's like thinking like a stone. And yes, this is the first part of the tutorial on how to make a map on for Ravenfield. And yes, see you in the second part.